who was the biggest influence on you early on and got you started in the game? You know, it was definitely my parents. Um, as a little kid, pretty much before I could remember, you know, I'd fall into the golf course, I'd, I'd fall into the range, and, and you just kind of, you just get that knack and you see what your parents are doing and that's what you want to do as a little kid. Um, and this was really early on. So this was, you know, when I was one, two, three, four, you know, just starting to walk. By the time I was five, I started taking these uh, little junior camps. And I think that's when my parents said, okay, we're done playing golf. Whether they were good at it or not, they took, <laughs> they stopped. They brought me to all my lessons. They did all that. Um, and that's what's kind of different than I feel like a lot of golfers these days, a lot of juniors coming up, is that, you know, it's a great family sport. I, th I think it's brought a lot out, um, especially through COVID, people finding their love for golf. But it wasn't that way. I, I found my love for golf through myself and I fell in love with it. And I think that's the best way anyone could was that there was no pressure by my parents to make sure I go play golf or play tournaments or go have to practice right after school. It was more about was I having fun? And, you know, you, you think golf in, in L.A. where I grew up, um, there's a lot of it, but they're not there isn't necessarily the best junior golfers in the country all in Los Angeles. You know, a lot are in Florida, a lot are in San Diego. Um, so I grew up playing by myself. And by the time I was eight, I met my coach who I still have today out on the tour, uh, Rick Sessinghaus. So I've been with him for 16 years and talk about a relationship, a friendship now that has grown. Um, there's nothing better I could have asked for because that's really um, how everything kind of got kickstarted, how I started playing tournaments, how I, you know, kind of just changed who I was as, as a five-year-old taking little junior golf lessons into something of this is what I want to do for the rest of my life.